Hey, what's up, guys? It's Lucklin from Minecraft Workbench. Today's an exciting day. Notch has released a patch for Minecraft that has fixed a lot of things for us. And uh, Notch, we appreciate all your hard work and everything that you're doing for us. Uh, today, I want to show you guys how to use the new feature inside of Minecraft called Mods and Texture Packs. It's actually really easy to use, and I'm going to just give you a real fast tutorial on what you need to do, and we'll just go from there. Alright, so let's say that you know you want to go download your favorite texture pack and we'll say from like your favorite site, maybe minecraftworkbench.com, just going to throw that out there. Um, what you're going to do is once you get the texture pack downloaded, you're going to go to the RAR file or the zip file, whatever it is, you're going to right click it and you're going to extract it whether you know you want to extract it to the name of the file itself or you can create your own name for the file whatever you want to do so we're going to just extract it and it's going to come to the desktop and we have a texture pack and then we go inside of it we have another folder called texture pack and then another folder called texture pack x the reason why i'm showing you this is because a lot of the mods that are out there some of them have a lot of subfolders we want to drill down to the main files that we need for the actual texture packs that will work inside of Minecraft. So what you're going to do is you're going to look for the ones that have the terrain.png, the GUI, the item, the terrain, and all this good stuff right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to just grab all of this. You're going to right click it and you're going to add to archive. And then what we're going to do is we're going to name it and you can name it however you want to name it. Uh, I'm going to just name this one uh, my, my texture pack or my pack. My pack. And we're going to do zip. Remember to do a zip file. RER will not work. So we're going to hit OK. And now we have our zip file here. So now what you're going to see is there's a there's two new folders inside of the Minecraft folder structure. So you're going to go to your users, your username, app data, roaming, Minecraft, and you're going to see a new folder called texture packs. The zip that we just made is going to go right inside of that folder. Once that zip is in that folder, you're going to go over to Minecraft, and you're going to click Mods and Texture Packs, and there it is, MyPack.zip. We're going to choose MyPack.zip. We're going to hit Done, and there you go. Now we have the new texture pack applied. So that's it. That's how easy it is to do. Um, I just wanted to make this video for you guys so you could understand how easy this was, and that's really about it. So, once again, I'm Lucklin from Minecraft Workbench, and if you guys have any questions or, or anything, please feel free to leave them in the comments. That's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.